Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here back with another five minute workout that can be done in the comfort of your own home with no equipment, no gym membership needed whatsoever so you have no excuses. And this is the one that's gonna help you build your shoulders. And if you wanna burn more calories, you burn more fat when you're doing this, you can put some warm, thick clothing on. I'm not doing that because I'm in Thailand, the aircon's off, the door's closed, so I am already sweating before I am starting this workout. And what we're gonna do is have 20 seconds rest in between each different exercise. All you need is a floor and a timer like so, and I'll explain each different exercise to you. If you do not know how to do push-ups with perfect form, make sure you go and watch my video where I explained to you how to do them with perfect form because this workout consists of many different push-ups and you wanna make sure that you have mastered the push-up before even doing this workout, otherwise you risk injuring yourself. And that's the last thing you want and that's the last thing I want as well. So, get your timer going like I am now. And first what you're gonna do is 15 push-ups slightly leaning forward. So, Instead of just being like here, what you can do is put the hand slightly further back and lean slightly into it. So it's a slight arch push up. And you wanna be doing 15 of these. And with this one, just put your hands back as far as you feel comfortable. And yeah, we will get started now. So I'm gonna just put mine slightly there and make sure that you are doing it correctly. So let's begin. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And yeah, we're doing 15, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And make sure that you are coming all the way down to the floor. Your chest doesn't need to literally touch the floor, but make sure that you are doing the full range of motion. Otherwise, you're pretty much just wasting your time. Make sure that you are really pushing through your shoulders. And next, we're gonna do 10 pipe push-ups. So, how you do these is lift your feet, well, put your feet closer towards you and be up at an angle, so you're gonna be like this, and do 10 of these. So, one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Woo, I'm definitely feeling that. If you're not feeling it, you're not doing full range of motion and you're not doing correctly. So yeah, another 10 seconds of rest. And the next one that we're gonna do is Hindu push-ups, which I really, really like these. And you're actually gonna do 10 of these. So how you do these is very, very simple. You be here and come down like that, up. Two. Three. I did that. I actually just made another workout video before this. So yeah, I'm already a little bit worn out. And that was very challenging. If you can't do 10, just do as close as you can to 10. And the next one I'm gonna do is planche holds. So 10 up first. So how you do these is have your hands slightly to the side and then you will slightly lean forward like so, and hold for 10 seconds at the top. And then 10 at the bottom. And this is gonna be absolutely killer for me. Should be for you too. If 
Five at the top. And five at the bottom. Five at the top. And five at the bottom. I'm sweating in balls, quite literally. And then another 20 seconds of rest. Make sure to breathe very deep. Definitely getting that pump going on. And the last thing you can do is as many as just standard push-ups as you possibly can. Just do literally as many as you can. And I'm probably going to do many because I'm quite worn out now. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And that was 11 for me. I'm going to stop now because my elbows are trying to slightly flare out because I'm finding it very, very challenging. If I do that, then I'm not doing perfect form. So if you start to notice that your form's breaking and that's happening to you, that means you've reached your max. So do not do any more. I actually need to catch my breath now. And yeah, I'm feeling really, really good from that. Good amount of endorphins going. And I'm sure you're feeling really good from it as well. And if you want to, you can do more the one round of this. You could do two, three, or even four. But for most people, two or three rounds of this is going to be more than enough. And I recommend if you do one to two rounds of this exercise, that you do this whole routine about two to three times a week. If you're doing three to four rounds, do it once to twice a week. That is absolutely fine. And as I mentioned earlier on, I mentioned it briefly, make sure that you're really pushing through your shoulders. You can really engage the shoulders as much as possible, so then you're tearing the muscle fibers as much as possible. So then when you're resting and recovering, the muscles are repairing themselves, so then they can grow. You're gonna get the best muscle growth that you possibly can for your shoulders and from doing this specific workout. And before I end the video, I wanna give a quick shout out to this fitness supplement company that I work with. They sell some of the cleanest fitness nutritional supplements in the world, such as this clean BCA flavored one that actually has no synthetic garbage in it whatsoever. Unlike a lot of these brands such as x which have so many different chemical preservatives and colorings and additives and flavorings that are really not good for you. But this one is completely natural. And they have a whole host of other different supplements, not just this BCA, some testosterone boosters, protein powders, and a variety of other different ones as well. And just for you, my viewers, there'll be a 20, 30% discount code that you can use down below so you can get a massive saving on anything on their website and there will be a link down below for their website. And man, I am sweating a lot. It's running all in my eyes. <laughs> so that's it for this video. If you have any questions for me, leave them down below. I always get back to anyone that leaves a comment every single time. Unlike a lot of YouTubers out there, I actually really, really like engaging with my fans and the community on YouTube. I really appreciate your comments. And if you want me to make any more type of calisthenics videos, let me down down below and I'll make them for you as soon as possible. If you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up. Make sure to share this with your friends, family members, other people that may want to do this workout as well. And don't forget to click that subscribe button and click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button otherwise YouTube will not notify you when new videos are uploaded to this channel and I have all different ones coming such as five minute workout videos, whole full body workout videos, calisthenics progression, how to calisthenics exercises. I've got one coming up soon of how to muscle up, so if you're interested in that, it'll be coming soon. Well, lots of videos, intermittent fasting videos, and all different other types of videos help you go in direction to gain and maintain the body that you desire, the fitness levels and the energy levels as well. Like I've managed to have many other people that followed my information consistently over time. Because as we know, nothing is just a quick fix. It's all about doing things consistently to actually gain and sustain certain results such as transforming your body. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go and get those gains. Peace.